Olá, my name is Rebecca and we're going to present a video about our project in Vigo. It's Speak Factor 3. Ciao a tutti, I'm Alessio and we took part in a beautiful training course where we learned how to overcome our fears and to public speaking, exercising like act, acting or speaking or debating or what else, my friend? Merhaba, my name is Darren and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video we've prepared for you. Bacalhau, é, bacalhau, baca bacalhau. Obrigado. After this experience, I am rich. And you? I am uh, ready to communicate my needs in an artistic way. Describe this experience in three words. I will say challenging inspiring and creative. Very inspiring indeed. <laughs> um, I would say innovative, freeing and delicious. Thank you. What do you think about the facilitators? Okay, that's a really great question. I think that they are both awesome. And you know, one thing that surprised me is that they are very knowledgeable about their subject. It's not your average facilitator that you see in an Erasmus Plus training course. And uh, I think to note for future Speak Factor versions, they are really close to the participants. You know, I never felt that there was this uh, power distance between us and the facilitators. And that made it quite a cool and awesome experience, dare I say. So yeah, all the best for them. I love you, Gabby and Fra! What do you think about taking risks? Taking risks is very important for our personal growth and, give, and can give us new experiences in life. So we are here on Erasmus Plus. Some beautiful people are here with us. We are here learning new things. And I'm just playing, hitting those strings And we're enjoying our time I'm singing, trying to find the next rhyme To sing the song for you Ooh, ooh, ooh. Erasmus Plus, Erasmus Plus To jest taki bardzo fajny czas Śpiewam teraz po polsku Was it a challenge to prepare this project? Um, I don't think it was a big challenge. I think um, the important part was to get to know the needs of the group and what was more useful or inspiring for you. But I don't think it was a big challenge because the passion and the willingness to connect was there. 
So it was more like a, let's say, exciting road more than a challenge. Thank you very much for doing this for us. My pleasure. What was your favorite uh, workshop in this project? My favorite workshop was probably a recreation of a famous uh, movie, I mean, fairy tale. Um, to me, it was the one where we were reflecting on our values and who we are. I mean, I do have to say all the sketches and improvisation, but I really enjoyed the debate as well. For me, <laughs> for me, my favorite one was the one where we were given a picture randomly and we had to make a story out of it. Thank you so much. What were your goals for this project and did you meet them? Well, I wanted to become more confident while performing and I think that yesterday on the stage I did feel more confident, so yes, I think I did accomplish my goals. What do you think about our team and this project? I'm super happy about the team we managed to gather here. It was a good uh, selection out of more than 700 candidates and I think that the selection was super well done. It's a combination of very different styles, very different characters, but in all cases, people with a lot of energy, a lot of ideas, and a lot of passion to communicate and to learn. It's not given that every project is like this, so I'm super glad that the team here was working so well, not only during the sessions, but also during all the free time and all the activities that all of you organize. Thank you so much. Did you meet your expectations on this project? Yeah, but honestly even more because I go home with a, a lot of new tools that will really be useful in my future career, I think. So thank you very much. something new that you learned from this project? Uh, for me, it was different type of tensions and how they can modify your presentation. Creativity, confidence, structure, presentation tools and how to support people. How was your experience as a volunteer in this project? Uh, I think the trip to Spain was really cool and then to come from the airport was cool and then I met Sotiris. That was a bit uh, less cool, I, I would say. What about you, Sotiris? Uh, I think meeting Joshua was one of the best experiences of my life. Uh, like I see him in my dreams, I see him in my my life. I want him every day with me. Like I cannot live without Joshua. Thank you so much. Thank you. What is an important lesson that you take from this project? Well, I think public speaking is an important tool, and it should be more taught at school than at university.